Hi everyone! <laughs> so I have on this funny minion hat because we've been working on making fair shares and we've folded things in half, we've seen um, videos about equal parts and you've read us you've listened to a story about fair shares and equal parts and making half of a set and half of like one whole candy bar or half of an orange we did all those kinds of things so today's lesson is pretty much the same we're still working on your I can state your I can um, statement which was I can solve equal sharing problems so I have this fun party hat the minion party hat today because I love the shape it's a cone shape See the inside look at that it's just a fun shape and I liked it and I thought hmm wow if I was gonna fold this hat in half what would that look like what would a cone look like in half it's kind of a fun way to think about it so watch I'm gonna fold it in half and look I have equal parts this cone this side here and this side here. It's two parts to this one hat. It's folded in half. I like that. I thought that was fun. I think cones are a fun shape to fold in half. So it's got the one side and another side and they're equal they're the same for both watch this if I folded it here at the top would that be half <laughs> that's not equal is it this little part looks like a triangle but then down here there's a lot of leftover part it's not the same shape. That's not half. That wouldn't work, would it? Nope. It's only half when it's the same on both parts. Okay? How about this heart? This came from the Valentine's party. See that heart? I love that shape. Hmm. What if you wanted to fold it in half? How would you do that? Let's see, what if I put this part here and folded it? Would that be folding it in half? Would that be a fair share? Hmm. Yeah, look how this shape doesn't match with the bottom. If I Hold it up again and you see that line. Look, this part is not the same amount as this part. It looks like this bottom part has more, right? It's not the same. That's not half. That wouldn't be folding this heart shape in half. Okay. Let's try another one. What if I just folded this little part up some? Is that the same? Is that folded in half? No, look. This little part, it's too small. See how it's white now? That little white part is too small. And I have all this red part left over. They're not the same, are they? They're not the same shape or size. In order to be half, it has to be the same shape and size, doesn't it? So let's go ahead. I bet you're thinking what I'm thinking. I bet you're thinking if I start here and go to the tip and we fold it in half sideways. Yeah. Ooh, look at that. There's the heart folded in half. I don't have any leftover parts. They're equal. This side is equal to this side. 
copy that and I can do it this way. I can fold it again on that same spot to turn it red. And look, there's no leftover parts. It's the same. This side is equal to this side. That's folding this heart in half. Now, how about this leftover party napkin? I have a big square napkin. Okay, this square napkin. What if I just folded this little corner here? Is that half? <laughs> That's not half, is it? Nope. This little corner is just a tiny piece, and I still have all of this heart part left over. Okay. What if I folded it here? Is that the same on both sides? Yeah. I don't have any leftover parts. It's the same. They're matched up equally on both sides. Now, what if I wanted to fold it a different way to make a different shape of half? Like if I fold it in half this way, that square rectangle, I mean that square, right? It's a square napkin. It becomes a rectangle if I fold it in half. But what if I wanted to try in half a different way. You think I could make it a triangle shape to show half? Let's see. What if I take this corner and this corner down here and I put them together? Let's see. I'm going to make sure they're really straight. Hey! Look! Is that half? that. I folded the square napkin in two equal parts. They're the same. And they're the shape of a triangle. That's a fun way to make half. So as we're finishing out this week, be sure to try folding things in different ways and see if you can make equal parts. Make half. Fold it in half different ways. There's not just one way sometimes. Like with this napkin, I can fold it in different ways to make half as long as my halves are the same, as long as I have two equal parts, the same shape and size. See that? Yeah. So enjoy exploring shapes some more. Enjoy exploring half. And I will see you later. Bye.